What makes a breed go extinct? Some are mated out, completely turned into new types of dogs to fit the fashion or function of the day. Others are wiped away by predators, humans included, or ignored by the breeders that had sustained them. No matter how it happened, extinction for dog breeds is permanent. Here are 10 examples of dogs that no longer walk the earth. Before we start the video, we want to mention that the dog videos in this video are dogs that are their offspring or just have the same look. Here we go. Number 10. German Bulldog Considered the godfather of large dog breeds in Germany, the Bullenbeiser existed in Syria and other regions of Asia and Africa around 2,000 years before 1 AD. For this reason, it's also considered one of the oldest dog breeds. According to records, they were of a strong and solid build, used for hunting animals, herding, and as a battle companion. Number 9. Hare Indian Dog According to existing records, the Hare Indian Dog resembled a mix between the domestic dog and a domesticated coyote. It was raised in the Hare Indian tribe, a Native American tribe located in what is now part of Canada. It was said to have had a playful personality and that it socialized very well with strangers. However, this didn't prevent it from being fast, agile, and a great hunter. As a faithful companion to the Native Americans, it began to disappear along with the tribe from which it gets its name, due in part to crossbreeding with other types of dog. Number 8. Cordoba Fighting Dog Originally from Cordoba in Argentina, this breed was the result of crossbreeding between several other dogs, including the Mastiff and the English Bulldog. Their body was usually white or sometimes with brown spots. With a massive, large, and energetic body, they were known to be extremely violent with other dogs, other animals, and even with dogs from their own pack. It was this violence which led to its early extinction. When it was not used in dogfights, they often fought each other to the death with minimal provocation. Number 7. Alpine Mastiff Disappearing at the end of the 19th century, these mastiffs inhabited the mountainous areas of the Alps. It was a dog of the so-called Molozer category, meaning it was large with strong lengths and an impressive musculature. They are considered ancestors of the current St. Bernard breed. In 1829, they were taken to England where they were mixed with other breeds. Additionally, this breed crossed indiscriminately with other dogs of the region, which is believed to have contributed to its disappearance. Number 6. Doggo Cubano Although not native to Cuba, this breed nonetheless proliferated on the island. Here, it was used for two reprehensible purposes, fierce dog fighting and retrieving escaped slaves from land holdings. Their body was solid and robust, with strong legs and a keen sense of smell. After the abolition of slavery was declared, the breeding of the dog Cubano, also known as the Cuban Mastiff, ceased to be of interest. Specimens were crossed with other breeds and it was eventually lost. Number 5. Paisley Terrier Created in the Paisley and Clydebank regions of Scotland, it was a small breed with a long coat. Sometimes considered a dog fancier's pet, it became popular as both a companion and show dog. Winner of contests and marketed as a lap dog for wealthy housewives, their fame began to decline due to the difficulty of caring for its delicate coat. Several crosses modified the breed until it eventually disappeared. Its legacy, however, still exists in other breeds, such as the popular Yorkshire Terrier. Number 4. Hawaiian Poi Dog Related to other Polynesian breeds, studies indicate that the Poi Dog arrived in Hawaii with the first Polynesian settlers around 400 AD. There, a variety was developed which moved away from its ancestors, eventually forming its own characteristics to distinguish them. Small-bodied, the Hawaiian Poi Dog was popular with local families as it was believed to protect the homestead. Gradually, it was also incorporated as part of the local diet. Despite an attempt to revive the breed in the 1960s, it was this, along with crossbreeding, that led to its disappearance in the 20th century. Number 3. Russian Tracker These big, around 100-pound dogs were bred in Russia and used by farmers in the Caucasus Mountains to guard livestock. In the 1800s, Sir Dudley Marjorie Banks, a real delightful name, watched Russian trackers perform as part of a circus in Brighton, England, and bought the entire pack. From that group, he eventually created the Golden Retriever, while the tracker quietly faded out. Number 2. Tequiqui Originating in Mexico, the Tequiqui is considered to be the pre-Columbian ancestor of the Chihuahua, as it was a dog bred by the Toltec civilization. Although there are few existing records to provide data on its characteristics, some remains have revealed the existence of the breed. Apparently, it was not only a companion animal, but there was also a certain religious symbolism surrounding the animal. 
the reason for its disappearance is not entirely clear, although the research has suggested two determining factors. That the Spanish developed a taste for the meat for the tiquiqui, and that they were bred with other breeds to the point of extinction. One such breeding dog was believed to be the Chinese Crested Dog. Number 1. White English Terrier Very little data exists on this particular breed, Perhaps in part due to its relatively short existence, white in color and fragile of health, it is believed one of the first specimens of this breed belonged to one Alfred Benjamin, who showed the dog successfully in competition. From then on, some breeders tried to establish the English White Terrier as a new breed and promoted its reproduction. However, the dogs were of such a weak build that they were unsuitable for work. This led the beginning of the breed and its eventual extinction to last a meager period of less than 30 years. That concludes our video of the 10 dog breeds that no longer exist. Which of these dogs did you find the most interesting? Which should still exist? Let us know in the comments. And if you like this video, then subscribe and turn on notifications so you'll be the first to know when a new video comes out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.